Hey guys, what's up? It's 8-Bit Eric. Today we're going to take a look at I and Me on the Nintendo Switch. I am going to review my review of I and Me. I don't know, I'm trying to be silly and you know, the premise of I and Me is actually kind of unique. It's a simple puzzle platforming type of game, but the concept is pretty neat, I guess. You control two cats at the same time using the analog movement. Yes, both cats control with the left analog stick. You can control them throughout the levels. There's about 90 levels where the goal is to reach both of your cats into the same picture frame. Now, eventually the levels of course go from simple platforming mechanics to avoiding pitfalls and obstacles to even having enemies like hedgehogs and we're not talking Sonic try to get in your way of this game. Now there is a level hint system if something gets a little too challenging for you it'll basically show you about 90% of the stage. I didn't run into that problem too often because this game is easy to pick up and play. In fact most of the levels you'll breeze through within 10 seconds, 20 seconds depending on how good you are. This game is obviously catered to younger children and younger audiences, so if you're, you're a hardcore gamer, you're probably not going to have much enjoyment out of I and Me. Now, let's talk about the graphics real quick. This game is all about that watercolor, gentle, you know, abstract type of look. Everything looks warm and inviting. Each of the levels are separated into four seasons, so there's summer, winter, fall, spring, and depending on what kind of level and season you're in is to how warm or cold looking the graphics are, but overall I thought it was a very artistic looking type of game, and for as minimalistic as it is, it was pretty cozy. In fact, this game is a perfect relaxation game, especially for the Nintendo Switch to be a pick up and go and play anywhere type of game. Throw this down, you know play it at the airport when you're feeling a little stressed out it might be something enjoyable for you to check out it's a basic game I mean once you're done with it you're probably not gonna go back to it there's not too much in way of unlockables or replayability no online leaderboards but it's a cute little game is it worth the price that it's in the eShop probably not but you know it could be a lot worse it could be room in the night sky so there was a good little effort when it came to developing I and me it runs smooth there's no frame rate problems there's no graphic problems the control might seem a little floaty at times and you know it's not too solid it's a little loose but it doesn't get in the hindrance of the game it's a game that is you know I, I don't know if you like puzzlers and you like something like this maybe check it out i know this came out on steam not too long ago so it's probably cheaper on steam i'm gonna go ahead and give i and me a five out of ten because it's right in the middle of not good or bad it's it's just a game this has been my review of i and me thanks a lot for watching guys i'll see you next time peace out